Hello and welcome to day 2 of getting closer to an A star in your IGCSC physics. The problem for the day is that we have a ball which is thrown vertically upwards with a velocity of 5 meters per second. We need to calculate how high will it go in its journey. The first step that we should do is to write the given information which includes the initial velocity represented by u as 5 meters per second. Since the ball moves vertically upwards, that is in a direction opposite to the acceleration due to gravity, therefore the acceleration should be taken as minus g. That is the acceleration in our case should be minus 9.8 meters per second square. The most important thing in this problem is to realize that at maximum height the velocity of the ball becomes zero and thus it starts to go vertically downwards. And we get the next piece of information that is the final velocity as zero. Since here the acceleration is minus 9.8 meters per second square which is actually a constant therefore we can use the equations of motion to solve the problem. On the basis of the information that we have, the equation of motion that suits the best is 2as equals to v square minus u square. On substituting the value of a as minus 9.8, v as 0, u as 5, we can solve for h which is the maximum height attained by the ball. On further simplification, we get h as minus 25 divided by minus 19.6. The negative signs cancel out and we are left with h as 1.28 meters. Thus, the maximum height attained by the ball is 1.28 meters. So this was it from my side. I'll see you in the next one. Till then, stay tuned. Thank you for watching.